What up, YouTube? This is Snod Juice. We got a quick mail day from Sush Boy. He sent me this Andre Allison 2007 Premier Rookie Auto, so that's pretty cool. Thank you, Mark. From Go Wisconsin Football, Chris. We made a trade. I was able to get this Justin Morneau Ultimate Patch, number 12 out of 35 office hands. Trade him a nice Ryan Braun, but this right here is sick, straight from my PC. Will always be there. So that's awesome. And he sent in this, and he also sent this Glenn Perkins Exquisite Auto. Thanks a lot. And I was in, um, I think, Redfern's room a couple nights ago after he logged off. I was talking to Mac and a couple other people, and we were talking about some of the best polls we, we've ever had. And this one's probably I sold for the most money. This is back in, let's see if I can get a date. October 1999. Of uh, base, uh, back at Baseball Card Monthly, so when they only had one. Let's see if I can find it here quick. Let's see, this is me, and I'm holding up, let's see, the article goes, strong finish, uh, most parents teach their children at an early age to finish what you start, for Scott Springborg, that's me, that's usually not a problem at his favorite hobby shop, Coin Connection in Overtly, Minnesota. On June 9th, he almost stopped one pack shy of a monster pole that would weaken the knees of even the most veteran collectors. I bought a box of 1999 Upper Deck MVP from my hobby dealer. I opened the box at the shop and then it was a Ken Griffey Jr. autograph game use souvenir number 19 out of 24. Now back in 1999 these were huge monster cards. Uh, anyway it just goes on about the article and me collecting and stuff, but at that time that card booked for four thousand dollars. I sold it for eighteen hundred, so that was probably my best pull ever. And I can actually say I'm one of the few on here. I know Tom has um, Hudson Fan 15 Rich Life Box, and I have also made Beckett Magazine, but mine was 11 years ago. So, peace out, guys.